Hello, Namaste, friends. Welcome to my channel. Today I came with another video. You can see on your screen. This is thermostat valve. So today I'm going to provide you each and every information about this thermostat valve. And uh, this valve is one of the major component of engine cooling system and is located on the top of the engine head or on the upper cooling lines. And this valve either cycle the hot water, uh, hot coolant uh, towards the radiator for cooling or it bypass the cool coolant towards the water pump for quick warm up of the engine by absorbing the temperature of the coolants. So these thermostatic elements transfer heat energy into mechanical energy using the thermal expansion of waxes when they get melt. Now let's see the name of the different component of this thermostat valve. You can see on top there is a bridge, piston, poppet valve or uh, you can say it uh, primary valve, seal, piston guide and there are two springs and wax pallet or you can say it uh, wax copper loaded uh, and uh, bypass valve. Now let me show you physically, you can see this is bridge, okay, this is main seal and uh, this is um, piston guide, there is inside piston and uh, here in the middle, you can see this is puppet valve or you can say primary valve and uh, these two are the spring and this down one, you can see here, which is movable, uh, this is bypass valve, it circulate uh, couldn't to ask the pump and you can see here inside the there is a wax loaded uh, copper when it get heated uh, it uh, the wax inside it get melt and expand and this primary valve will open and the coolant will circle cycle to the radiator now this uh, animated section you can see how thermostat valve will open after getting heat and uh, after reducing the heat uh, and uh, uh, below the engine working temperature valve will remain closed primary valve and it bypass the coolant towards the pump and uh, for quick uh, quick warm up of engine and after getting heat it will transfer to the uh, radiator upper tank for cooling as shown in the video now i'm going to do some uh, experiment that how uh, this uh, primary bulb will open so okay let's see uh, I'm going to keep this thermostat bulb inside the boil water then we will see okay we will see the result so let me let me bring water uh, uh, boil water and uh, this thermostat bulb primary bulb will open after getting heat and it allows coolant to cycle towards the radiator for cooling so le let me keep this one inside the boil water and uh, we shall wait for a few minutes then we will see the result okay after few minutes keeping inside the uh, boil water this uh, primary valve of uh, thermostat valve is start to open it's already open now you can see on your screen it's open so from this uh, portion this from this valve uh, this thermostat valve uh, allow coolant to cycle towards the radiator for cooling okay so after uh, around more than uh, 83 degree tem temperature celsius temperature uh, it start to open okay it depends upon the thermostat so uh, let me take it out from water boil water now it will now i already remove it from water okay boil water now this valve gradually uh, start to close okay you can see here it will close very soon because uh, temperature of uh, this uh, wax pallet start to go down then uh, you can see now it already already closed now it's uh, it's closed now completely closed so in normal temperature this valve remain closed and uh, this valve bypass the coolant towards the uh, water pump for uh, warm up of the engine and after getting some heat to optimize the engine temperature or to increase the engine performance this uh, primary valve will open 
and you can see here this valve thermostat valve is rated 76.5 degree centigrade temperature so it means this is the minimum temperature from which thermostat valve start to open its primary valve to send the hot coolant towards the radiator for the cooling and you can see here the here inside this is the wax there is a wax inside it so it means uh, that temperature on that temperature this wax is start to getting melt and because of that yeah it open uh, its primary bulb to send the coolant towards the radiator for the cooling so overall we have two cases cold engine and hot engine now let's see cold engine there is a low temperature and this valve prevents coolant from leaving the engine and being cycled to the radiator for cooling this allow the coolant to warm up with the engine heat and in hot engine cases after running few minutes it start to increase the coolant temperature and because of that this valve allow to pass the coolant towards the radiator upper tank for cooling from this all uh, this valve is responsible for moderating the temperature of the vehicle engine okay and if this valve got damaged our engine is at risk of running too hot and overheating or running too cold and shutting down depends upon the failure of thermostat valve so this valve keeps the engine at its optimum temperature meaning the parts of our engine system can work to the best of their ability and will last longer so this is all about the thermostat valve thanks for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel uh, thank you and have a good day